Hello and welcome to Minecraft. This is Paul's Westward Expansion, where we will be moving out west as much and as frequently as possible. I won't be building any homes or slowing down at night time, we'll just keep on going and take care of any monsters that uh, turn up in our way. Oh wow! A snow map! I haven't played a snow map before. And okay, well that's east. This is north, and it's that's to the west. Oh, snow map. This will be interesting. Um, it means we don't have to build any any boats to keep on going, which is um, that's quite a nice little benefit. Okay, uh, we're going to need things like. Um, stone to make make a decent enough sword so let's get some wood and put together a crafting table so we can make a pickaxe we'll start off with a wooden pickaxe a very temporary wooden one so we can get some stone and I saw also a little bit of coal over there as well yes some coal here so let's see uh, that's enough for a workbench. I'll need a couple of handles. And let's get this workbench up and going. Hey, we slide on the ice too. That's nice. even a chicken. Well, need to take care of plenty of those in the future so that we can use their feathers for arrows. But at the moment let's get some stone for which we can make a few decent tools. a sword, several for a pickaxe, and eight pieces for a furnace, so that we can then cook up food and have it uh, heal us up much more effectively. That should be enough to get us going. Right. stone pickaxe. We'll keep using the wooden one for now until it breaks. Uh, sword. In fact I'll make another sword as a backup. And a shovel. I'll make a couple of shovels so that we can get some flint when we uh, come across some gravel. Yes, yes. Okay, that's enough shovels. And on we go. Okay, uh, Westwood Ho. Oh, that's lovely. We can uh, start collecting some food to help us survive the night time. I'll just move this axe to slot 3. No meat. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for more as we go. We may want some leather from cows, definitely feathers from chickens, pigs, and that should help to see us right. So I'm looking for animals, gravel, and perhaps some 
some coal there to help us out when uh, cooking up the meat. We can cook with wood, but it means spending more time collecting that wood. Okay, yes, yeah, so we'll just do this opportunistically as and when we come across it. We won't do any special mining expeditions. We'll just uh, keep on moving west and taking things as they go. be a zombie in a cave or even a dungeon just near the surface. We're not worried about him. I'd like to take just a moment here to thank Craven Lupe for the idea of the, the series of doing a Westwood expansion. I first got interested in the idea of it when uh, I saw his, his videos about it and uh, if you haven't seen them already, check them out and uh, have a good good watch through them. I'll put a link to, to his series down below as well. Now the sun is starting to come down and night will be approaching, so let's let's put together a furnace so that we can cook up this this meat that we have. It's not much, but it will help. So we'll keep an eye out for more pigs as we go. If we do get into any battles, we will need to heal up. Especially if they're skeletons. We don't have any bow or arrows to take care of skeletons yet. If we do come across any, we'll try and dodge them as we go. find some pigs. No, not zombies, pigs. And if I can get any leather from cows, that uh, will eventually become useful to help limit the amount of damage that we take. Oh, a mushroom. Okay. If we find the uh, brown mushroom as well, we can then use that to make a really healthy meal. So night is approaching, we have our sword, we have a piece of meat <laughs> to heal us up. So we'll have to be a bit careful as we move. When we see things coming up, we'll um, 
try and avoid some of them. Hopefully take care of some of them too. And now since we're approaching dusk and night time, I will hold the video here so that we can do the, the night time part in uh, the second part of day one.